Now next month is when we're planning on going to West Virginia, but I'm still getting my junk ready to go. Because I'm lazy. So I want to do it as I go. And not wait till the last minute. I want to make me a new dress to wear down there. And this is the one the, uh, material that I chose. This uh, pattern says we need four yards. And I'm pretty sure I have over four yards. Now, the uh, numbers, uh, uh, the style of it is L94043. So, this is what it looks like. And I'm going to do the one with the sleeves on it. So, if I want to wear it in the wintertime, I can. In the summertime, I don't, I've got, I've got to have my sleeves. Or I could just put on that uh, sweater that uh, Leo sent me. <laughs> Alright, so that's what we're going to work on now. sure I mark right here and make sure it's on the other side as well because this is where my pockets go now, I got that one done the hem will cover that up and you won't be able to see it and on top of all that I took and uh, And, and cut it and cut it down some more. Okay, this is interface, and I don't, I don't want it. Don't need it. I'm going to use the uh, binding as I go. So I don't need these. I'm going to put these in here. So when I get them out, I'm going to get them no more. I put them down inside the bucket. But in the bag, but it'll be okay. We'll do it like that. Alright, so now I've got my pockets and I got my uh, sleeve here. So I think we're ready to go. Except for, I want to make sure that I put my pockets on this one as well. We want pockets. There's that one. That one. that one. Now we have pockets. Alright, so what I need to do now is take all these pins out. And you can see right here, let me get this one here loose and I'll show you where I put it at. Put my, uh, how long I want it. And all that good junk. All right, so right here is the suggestion. This side, no, need one on the door. Is right here, and I went four inches down because I like mine longer. I don't like it above the knees. I like it below the knees. So, therefore, I have this one done. Now. We're happy about that. Now, we're going to go ahead and take out all the pins and everything, and then we'll be back. Man, I'm a 
must be on the lazy side, having to carry all that stuff back in here, and all. I'm the, I'm tired now. All right. So here's her sleeves. We're gonna put them to the side, and we're gonna put that to the side. And we got this one and this one. Now this is the front. That's why it's got a heart on it. Because we're going to have the heart. Okay, now, I want to put the pockets on first this round. Because this is going to be a very easy dress to work with. We don't want this side. We want this side. And we're going to put the extra on the top. Then that way, we have the extra on the top. Alright. Now, we get this other side. Uh, this is going to be a very easy dress. Alright, we're going to put the extra on the top. Got to make sure what we're going to do when we do it. Now, that one's ready to sew down. I hope that uh, that this right here is going to turn out because I don't want it if it's not going to. <laughs> it's a real pretty material. I like the material to it. Alright, we want this one. And it goes to the top, the extra best way to do it is to keep it consistent. Okay. Alright. Now, the only reason why I did it this way is so I can go take me a break. Ha ha ha. And it gives me enough to look at while I'm taking my break. I'm going to sew them down and what I'm going to do after I sew them down is I'm going to sew them on this right here on the other side so they will stay in and see how that goes because we don't want pockets coming out. I have these done. Yes, yes. Now, I sewed them down this way first and then I sewed them down this way. So that uh, they will work pretty good in in the pocket area. So I'm happy about that, y'all. Cut off these strings before I go any further. God knows I don't want my strings. Oh, I hate them. Well. That one. Now we got one more over here. Get rid of all of these strings. If the scissors will cut. Alright, that right there is okay. Alright, now I want to put my Rick Rack around my neck. Now, Rick is the one that picked out the color. I do have yellow, but he wants red on it. So I'm going to put. Uh, one around this neck and one around the other neck and then we'll be back when I get done with that. Now, I think this will turn out pretty neat, I hope. Shoo we I thank God he changed his mind. Cause he oh yeah, he was gonna put any red on there. And I'm glad he did. I don't want no red on it. really I don't. I got the big one. I got a big project I'm doing here. Alright. Let's see what we can do about getting rid of that. Putting that over there. And I'm going to get rid of this front pin. I'm afraid I'm going to lose it. Alright. There's that. And then we got that one. Alright. Now... We are going to put the uh, 
binding across the bottom of our sleeves. I wish I'd have done the sleeves different and made them kind of puffy. Not real big puffy, but kind of puffy. All right, we got the arms done. And now we want to cut off these sides here. We don't want them no more. We'll throw them away. Now, what we want to do now is see. Grab, 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 grab it. And I want to put them pretty sides together. And put these together. Well, look at that. That is most definitely different. All right, let me turn this one right here to the side. I want to make sure that these are right. All right, now I'm going to go down here. All right, now I need some pins here. All right, now what I'm going to do is after I sew them down, I'm going to cut that off. Because that's not... No, it's just not kosher. Alright, let's see what we have. I've got to get a pin. Pin it down. Like that one right there out. Pin it down. Alright, I'm going to sew them down. This is a very easy dress to do. <laughs> and oh, I'm going to put some kind of button on it too. I like buttons now. Alrighty, want to make sure we don't forget to back stitch. Because we don't want it falling apart on us while we're driving down the road. <laughs> Alright, now we got that right there. And I am just going to cut it. Now I got the other side to go. And we are just going to. Got it. All right. Now, um, nope. can't get that in office. Is that the other one right there? Same way. All right. I'm gonna go take me a break, and when we come back, I'm gonna have the uh, sleeves put on. I think what I was trying to say. I hate forgetting. I hate it. I'm getting worse and worse at it every day. Alright, I've decided to come back and show you how I'm going to put the, so uh, the, the sleeves on just in case you need to do. Which I kind of doubt it. Y'all probably know more about sewing clothes than I do. Alright, we're going to go with this one. Oh, wait a minute. I want to half it in half first. I don't think this is going to, um, be puffy sleeves, but just for an end case, we're going to start this one, and I gotta find me some yellow, uh, buttons, cause I wanna put buttons on the front of it. And I also thought about putting in a couple darts. I did think about that. And before I go any further, I believe I ought to try and see if I want to or not. Oh no, that kind of looks so super can't kind of like master it back together. I don't want a needle in this thing. All right, now let's see what we can do. About putting this together, and I also found out too what you wanted to is make sure that you don't go. You want to go a little bit bigger on your stitches. You do on your seam allowance. You don't want to go right here at the end. You want to go right here. About right here, about half an inch in. Yep, yeah, you sure do. You want to do that. I have, I've only had one garment 
start coming apart on me because I got it too close to the edge. So one out of all of them I've already done, that ain't bad at all. All right, look here. We're gonna have this a little bit. All right, let's take this one. And I want to, yes. I'm gonna take this one up to here and then I'm gonna put it like that and then I'm gonna fold it. Fold it, fold it, fold it. All right, now I'm gonna do this one the exact same way and fold it back. So now and then we have it folded back. All right, that's the way I'm gonna sew them down and I'm gonna do the other one the same way. And then we'll be back when we get done with that and then we'll think about the darts. All right, right or wrong or indifferent, this is the way I'm going to do this. I'm to come up here. Excuse me. To that right there, my, the tip of my shoulder. And we come down as 15 inches. So I'm going to take it from this one all the way down 15 inches. And then we'll take it all the way back down a little bit further. And I'm going to go 8 inches. And then I'm going to take this. I'm going to line it up with the little uh, curve starts. And then down here. And that way. And the same on this side. Right here. That's the way I'm going to start it out. And then I'm going to take it and fold that. Fold that. I don't want the other side. I only want this side. And now pin it above it and pin it below it. Now when I go sew it, I want to back stitch it front and back so here we go and we're not going to know what it looks like until after we get it on us and see what it looks like <laughs> I will make sure I put it on the front <laughs> not the back oh boy that'd be bad alright let's well you ain't going to see it that way let's throw it this way Oh my gosh, that's pretty well much perfect. <coughs> I'm liking that. I like that. Okay, now. Let's go. And let's see what else we're going to do with it. I like that. I'm glad that worked out fine. Alright, now. Let's go. Let's see if we can't get one side, and I want, right here underneath the armpits, I want them, uh, right more than anything. So we're going to lay those together, <laughs> and we're going to grab pins over here. And that way I got pins over here. I mean, what do you mean? Alright. Uh, like getting rid of? We're gonna pin it right here where the pockets are. See, I don't want that little baby one. I don't want them. All right, yeah, and. Uh, I don't like grabbing them. Let's get them out of my way. Alright. I'm going to sew both of these down. I'm going to do the other one the same way and make sure that they're all together good. Alright. We'll be back. Alright. This time I figured I would show you again and show you sewing it down. 
I want to make sure these are right. I left my pins over here. Believe you me, I got a pile over here now. Right. And then I want to get this one. I know, right? I was like, what the fuck? June, man. Supposed to be snowing June. <laughs> uh, now we want to go on down. Now I want to get these two straight. Like that. And then I just need to put one over here. Alright, now let's see what we can do about sewing them down. Alright, now you really want to make sure you back stitch on your arms because you don't want them coming apart. <sighs> and I forgot my pins again. It's okay, I got me another pile over here started, so I'll make it bigger. about a pressure foot amount past my line of where my pocket and my dress uh, connects. Now I'm going to turn it over. Mama Cat, what's up? I'll let her out. There you go, Mama Cat. All right, here we go. And we're just going to go through to that right there, and I'm going to readjust everything. <laughs> Alright, I'm stopping it right there. If you go even way up here, it's just your pocket. But now you want to make sure you got enough a seam allowance that it's not going to come loose and lose your jump. All right, so let's see if I fix that. Go up. I want to make sure I got this right here straight. All right, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in about a uh, pressure foot length. Now I'm going to turn it. And now I'm going to go down. And the pressure foot length is a good length for you. No matter what you're doing, you will always get it just perfect on your pressure foot length. Alright. Now all we have is the hemming to do. And I'm going to hem it and then we'll be back. And I'm going to put the yellow uh, cord around it. Alrighty, I have it done. I put a button here and a button here and three here. I was going to put four here, but I lost one. So, it doesn't matter. Alright, let's see if we can't make one of these right here. Smaller ones. Um, i got to get something to draw with. I forgot. i got to have something to draw with. Alright, All right, let's make sure I'm going. Yeah, I'm going. Gotta make sure the numbers are going up. Alright. So here this is. I'm going to lay it right on top. I wish I could pin it to it. And I'll be... No, uh-uh. I'm going to draw a straight line down that way. Very easy. And, and I'm giving myself seam allowance as I go. 
He ain't that purdy. He ain't that purdy. A pur, a purdy. All right, let's take this to six inches. Tighten this down. Oh, it don't tighten down, but boy, I tell you what, it feels awful loose. All right. Anyway, now we need this. Or so I ain't got my. All right, let's get back to this. And we're going to cut it. I feel sorry for you guys that have this type of a uh, cutting blade because if you don't keep your finger right here on this right here and I'll, it seems to close up on you and I don't like that alright now we got this right here We're gonna, and this is my salvage right here so I can keep that together and we can fold it and we'll take the top of it. Oh man, it's not gonna work. Oh man, I don't have enough. I don't have enough. Alright. See what else we got over here. Alright, here we go. Now, let's see if we can't. Now Cat, I done tried letting you out and you didn't want to go out. Let's see what we can do. About Three. Putting this right here together. All right. Oh what? Oh, you didn't ever even turn it on. Okay, Mr. Rick. We're gonna start all over again. <laughs> start your timer. Yeah. You poor. <laughs> he forgot to turn his eye on. Here we go again. <laughs> I hate doing it. I hate it. I hate doing that, Rick. I'm telling you, I hate it. Okay. <laughs> it happens sometimes. Yeah. Alright, let's see what we can do about cutting. Right down this way. Alright. Get rid of that. And we'll go ahead and chop that down. I ain't gonna feed that to them. They don't act like they want it. I'm trying to find my. There it is. It's gonna, it anyhow. it's gonna be a real small um, place. I hope. Yeah, my elastic will go in there. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, let's give this right here a sew down and a turn around. And we'll see what happens from there. Hopefully it'll turn out pretty good. Alright, I got it done. Now I want to take this in, fold it through, put my elastic in here, and find me a pin. Take this one, roll these sides. Well, probably better if I put it this way. Then that way I can do the sides. We want these sides looking good. Right there. Pin. Make sure we get this side. The pin. A bunch of it over here. Mm, right there work. Right here. Work on the other side. Do 
Here. Gonna work. Make sure. Just open the door, get off there. And now. Now we're going to take this side. Push it in. Make sure that ain't twisted. Put it in. Put a pin there. Alright, I'm going to sew it down. And then I'll show you all what everything looks like when I get done with it. Alright, this is what I'm going to look like driving to West Virginia when I go. And I hope you can see my hair thing. Oh, no you can now. Yeah, <laughs> what do you want? What do you want? Uh, what do you want, buddy? Cherokee, no, that's not Cherokee. All right, all right. I'm going to try to quit now. I don't know if I'm going to be able to or not. I'll see y'all later. How to donate to Poor Man Sewing. Mash on Poor Man Sewing. Come up here to the top. Go to a bout and right here donate to poor man sewing.